Hey lovelies, welcome to Blenny Alert. Today I'll be teaching you how to make a 720 degree flare, a full flare that is as full as the one on the video. So please stay tuned to the end of this video. I'm going to break it bit by bit. I'm going to give you the easiest way to calculate your 720 degree flare and get it perfectly. So if you are new to my channel, please go and click on subscribe button. If you are old and you have not clicked on subscribe button, please go and click on subscribe button. Please support my channel by sharing this link on your Facebook page and also giving this video a thumbs up that's a like and dropping your comment in the comment section so two power arrow square is the formula we are going to use which is a constant formula so it's equals to 22 over 7 so when you use the 7 to divide 22 it's going to give you 3.14 as shown in the video times 2 which will give us 6.28 so when you are looking for the radius of a circle of a 360 degree circle you are going to divide it by the 6.28 that we got so three a 720 degree flare means 360 degree times 2 which is 720 degree flare so that is it so a 2 a 360 degree make a 720 degree flare so like i told you 2 power arrow square is a constant formula which is 22 over 7 and i've shown you how i did that so 20, 25 is the radio and that's the circumference of the um the waist measurement so we are just going to divide it by the 6.28 we got using that 2 power arrow square the, the answer it gives to you you are just going to uh, divide it by so remember the 3.98 it gave to us it just for one 360 degree flare and a 720 degree flare means two different 360 degree flare so we'll go ahead you go ahead and use the answer and divide it by two so whichever answer it gives to you that's what we use in measuring the waist circumference while folding the fabric so i got 1.99 uh, as the answer so i'm going to use the 1.99 to cut my three my 720 degree flare so you can fold your fabric into four by cutting just one 360 degree flare first and cutting another one while folding another fabric into four but you can also fold it into it as shown in the paper as i folded it so my fabric is unfold into four so i'll go ahead and minus the one point that is mark the 1.99 all round as shown in the video if you do not understand just go ahead and watch the video carefully again so i'll go ahead and measure that 1.99 all through my tip as shown in the video then i'll go ahead and confirm the measurement by taking in the circumference the way i show using my tape to see if if you times it by four it will get half of your waist measurement so i'll go ahead and from that 1.99 i'll measure the length of the flare if the flare is six you go ahead from that 1.99 measure six if it's eight if it is 20 you go ahead and measure the length as shown in the video so what next we are going to do after measuring that to confirm if your circumference is sorry your flare is really round you go ahead and add the 1.99 to the length of your flare if it is 10 you add 1.99 and confirm it if 1.99 plus 10 if it's if it corresponds with the length of your flare so i'll go ahead and cut this off and cut the mid part of it you can see how it looks and i went ahead to use it to cut another 360 degree flare making it two different 360 degree flare so by the time i slit it i add them together at the edge one edge it will give me the waist circumference that i desire so you can see that it's two different 360 degree flare so you can see that uh there's no slit at all so when folding your fabric ensure that there's no slit you can see mine now so i'll go ahead and slit the side so that you see how it looks like and it's really looking beautiful and it is really full and it is draping so i'll go ahead and cut it at the side and join it at the side so that you can see how it looks so you can go ahead and use this to cut your lining and 
workout whatever maybe add crinoline look at her it looks like i've added band to mine already you can see how full the flare is you can go ahead and add crinoline for watching this video if you are new to my channel you have I've been watching my video and my video have been useful to you. Please go and click on the subscribe button. Please support my channel by sharing this link with others, by giving this video a like, and also sharing the link on your social media page. Please stay tuned to my channel. Thank you for watching this video. I hope this video has been helpful. Follow me on Instagram, Beleni Alor. Bye.